to win the MVP. And the last one was, of course, Wilt Chamberlain. So you're in very special company. So it's my honor and my pleasure to present you Steph Curry with the 2014-15 Kia MVP Award. Hey guys, H Town Kick 713 coming back with the new vid here to open the 2016 season. This is my first pickup of the new year. You are looking at the Under Armour Curry One. This is the friends and family MVP edition of the shoe. So this released January 1st, 2016 to kick off the new year. Retailing here in the United States for $109. And the color you're looking at today is the uh, pretty much white and metallic gold throughout. And the only thing I'd say about the white, when you look at it, the pictures here, you know, when you look at the photograph pictures, the white is probably a little more glossy, a little more vibrant in the pictures than in person. When, you, when I look up close to this, this portions of the upper, it's, it's a little more dulled out. So just something to note, not as uh, glossy as here near the, uh, this portion of the shoe as you're looking at now. So that's the only thing I'll mention about the, the color there. But let's look at the DNA of the shoe here. So they are going with this charge uh, foam. All I could say is, is, you know, it's nothing. It's a firm feel. Nothing, um, nothing too bad. Nothing too great. Just, just somewhere in the middle. You know, nothing to, uh, to, uh, you know, to praise or anything like that. It's just, just okay, I guess I would kind of rank it. But if we look at the, uh, the upper here, you know, they are going with this kind of this anti foam. And uh, you know, the material there on the upper there, it's kind of. Um, I almost feels kind of like a kind of rubberish there, in terms of you know it's kind of if you spill water on it, it'll just kind of you know come right off or just fall on down. So uh, pretty durable material. I did, I did have a question about breathability, but they did add these preparations here as we look up close on the side and on the top there of the shoe too. They did add some preparations as well. Going up from the bottom side to the tongue, going for this mesh and the shoelaces, the white shoelaces with the kind of the gold hints throughout. Good shoelacing system, I do like it. I do like the shoelaces used. Um, they're kind of, uh, they'll stick together in terms of they won't uh, come loose or anything like that. Come up with the 30SC logo there in gold. And on the back of the tongue, I guess the uh, unique feature, the key feature there, uh, design is the uh, 2015 MVP for Stephen Curry. So this original release, I believe they said just for his friends and family, but it did release it to the public here on January 1st. Work our way to the side here. You know, the nice thing, I, probably the best part of this shoe is this gold uh, metallic uh, Under Armour logo there on the side. That's actually very nice. Comes off the light real nice. Work our way to the back. Kind of see that uh, kind of heel counter there in the back and then the, uh, the SC30 logo there for stability and support. Got the white insole with some gold hints. And just the other, other portion of the shoe is the bottom sole of the shoe. We are looking at, they have the Under Armour logo in white. Kind of herringbone traction in translucent. Gold plated, uh, kind of almost like a shank plate there. And so you can see they kind of shortened up the, uh, kind of the, the bottom sole there. And you kind of see these hints of these kind of, and you know, it's not dirt. It looks like kind of like gold nuggets throughout the bottom of the sole, the translucent sole there, and continue out the herringbone traction at the top. So that's it. That's about it, guys. Just a kind of quick review. Um, in terms of this, you know, I still like uh, for some reason the Curry Two, uh, which I picked up recently as well. It seems to have a little more responsiveness, not as firm as this shoe. Um, I will still go true to size on this if you're looking to pick this up. Did feel a little bit, uh, a little bit loose there. Maybe had a little more room in the up front, so I possibly could go down a size if I really wanted to snugger fit. Right on that, that's it, guys. Uh, thanks for watching today, and you guys have a great one. Take care.